hunts of a non-native antelope here in the valley have sparked controversy, but wildlife officials say it's necessary to protect local cattle. CBS 4's Patrick Chalvier is in the studio to explain that. Patrick. Marcy, decades ago, South Texas ranchers brought over the Neogai antelope from a California zoo. However, the once rarity in South Texas has now become a nuisance. The Neogai, a possible nemesis to the local cattle ranchers, carries a deadly tick to herds and poses a competitive threat for the Rio Grande Valley species for food. In recent years, federal officials have recommended them to be hunted as, as helicopters fly over the herd and a sharpshooter guns them down. However, they've received some backlash. Wildlife experts say just today, nearly all of the neogai that were hunted were found to be carrying the fever tick. There really are no other ways to do it more humanely. This is the most efficient, economical, and humane way to do it. And again, I'll just reiterate that this is a non-native species that um, we have a mission at the Fish and Wildlife Service and at Laguna Atascosa to try to control. This unit that we're conducting this harvest on and all other units where we've conducted harvests are not open to public hunting right at this, at this moment. At the turn of the century, cattle ticks wiped off 90% of the U.S. cattle industry with the deadly Texas fever, something wildlife officials say they hope to avoid. The neogai carcasses don't just go to waste, they're butchered and the meat now goes to Trinity Oaks, a nonprofit organization that then feeds the meat, safe for human consumption, to needy families. In the studio, Patrick Shalvier, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.